Hello guys, here is Oli speaking. I try to uh, explain the uh, force feedback base from Brunner. I hope you can understand my English. So let's start. <coughs> Now, this is the Brunner CLSE force feedback base and I use the Thrustmaster Hotters stick to f fly. You can buy this with the uh, uh, stick of the Airbus or a um, default fighter jet stick. So, But if you have a uh, Hotter system from, from Thrustmaster you can use this You can uh, uh, put this uh, stick so as a uh, 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 hotter system. Here you can um, fix this with the with the screw here, and now you can play. So now you see the stick is not working with uh, uh, the force feedback is not activated so we have to activate the force feedback okay let's do that so here you can see the uh, uh, control program of the runner And uh, <coughs> you can use different profiles. You can uh, create own profiles, or you can um, um, download the profiles from the profile manager. And in the profile manager, you, you have a profile cloud where you can download the existing profile, or you can upload your own profiles. So you see, uh, the stick or the base is connected, but not initiated. Now we can initiate this. So, okay. Now we can turn back to the simulator. So, and Now we have an force feedback activation here. So you can see the aileron have not not any force because uh, we are not uh, uh, in the air and uh, so we have no force to the aileron. So here you can see the elevator. The elevator uh, turns down because of its own weight. And if we have enough uh, speed, the aileron, uh, uh, the the elevator. Um, align here with the elevator uh, blade so let's try out with this little bird here in the wonderful area of Innsbruck now let's start the machine Now we jump in the cockpit where I have the switch here. Okay, you see here the stick move move uh, 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 is moving uh, down down pitch. So let's start this little bird. Okay, we must the master battery, avionic, 
So, fuel is right, left is okay. Out. Okay, we let we let the fuel to the no to the left side. Okay, trim. Can we trim here? Have we do the trim here? No. Okay, I have forgotten to mask the trim here. Okay, but that's not a problem. Okay. Then we can start. Okay, the engine is working. Very good, then we can we can uh, do the parking brake off. That's okay. So that's my throttle, that's the propeller. Okay. Now I feel the uh, uh, the engine power, the vibration of the engine here. I think you can't see that. Okay, then we have to do find the runway. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think we have to change direction. So be careful. Be careful. Oh, that's hurt. Uh, ah, okay. That's good. So. What we see here, oh, there is a nice bike. Wonderful, okay. So, the man here, oh, he has disappeared. Okay, no problem with that. We are here at the Sport Flyer. Uh, area, sport planes, and not at the other side where the uh, airliner are parking. Now here is a taxi way to the runway. Oh, that's that looks great here. Okay, we do this without uh, without control communication because we have to focus to to this thing here. Yeah, As you see the force will be with us. So we get to the I think we do not go to the end. We have a short way for flying. So okay. How I can show you this, the start force at the best. Okay, I get 
I jump to the extern view, so then we do the flaps one have we enough flaps here yes okay okay then we start So that was not a good start, but you see, the stick don't get to the uh, front, so we have power. Oh, 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 that was very dangerous. Okay. So, we have here a little turbulence. Okay. Now we do a little turn here and, and you see the turbulence of the... You have to, to uh, uh, control the stick. Because of the turbulence, they can... They can... Uh, uh, disturb your flying. So you have... To, to put your hand on the stick without this can I make a crash so now we are on the in the wood that's not good <laughs> in the wood that's not good Okay, so we try to see the stall effect. I bring the engine up to idle and try to hold the altitude. What you are feeling is that the stick is uh, have not so much power with the force feedback as we uh, fly in full speed because this, this, uh, uh, the force at the aileron and the elevator um, is not so high if we fly uh, if we fly with minimum speed so I get a little bit I take the nose uh, up to the air and we try to get into the stall yes here we have a stall now that's this that, that's the sign of the stall and we are thinking we decrease we see this knot at the plane so we have to put down the nose get speed and we are out of the stall
Okay, we have here uh, little force. We can we can uh, feel the the force at the stick. Now we get at max ma maximum speed. Oh no, yes, it's if I get go into the turn, I get the fourth of the elder one. No. We're flying a little bit higher. Because I want to do some uh, some maneuver. That's not too dangerous if we are flying too low or in low altitude. And the area looks very beautiful. So now we get in an, a dive and try to make an <laughs> a looping. <laughs> okay. The speed is high, and the the uh, force is is uh, high too. And now we get in the in the looping. Okay. Is a little bit uh, yes, uh, schwächer and a little bit uh, not so strong. <laughs> because the speed is down, now we get more speed here. I have to look where the at the airport where we can land here. Okay. You see the force it is very very strong because we have maximum speed. Now we get the turn to the airport. And if you don't, uh, if you don't have a stick in in your hand, several turbulence can cause a crash. Okay, then we line up to the.
to the one way. I hope I crash. I have no crash. You see, then if we have a l lower speed, the force are low to are lower to. So I hope you can understand my English. So there's the one way, okay. Engine idle, now it's up. And that's what's the landing. Okay. Brake. So Now that was uh, playing with little birds, now we see a little helicopter, okay. That's in the next chapter. Okay, welcome to chapter 2. Flying Microsoft Flight Simulator with Brunner CLSE, Force Feedback Base, Thrustmaster Hotos Stick, and a little helicopter. So, before we start, we have to change the uh, Force Feedback Profile to the Helicopter Profile. Okay, let's do that. So we see here the control <coughs> the control system control program. Now we have here the my profile for little flyer. Now we can choose the profile for helicopter. Helicopter without hydraulics or poor. So I have a uh, create a helicopter profile poor for a little helicopter okay now we see we have no force at the stick then we initi initiation this profile so we get the green light and we have a force you see the stick will not get to the middle. I have to, to put the middle to find the middle. I think that's the right way of little helicopter. Okay, then we can start it. So we jumped into the cockpit, but. It, because it is very difficult to fly a helicopter in the outer uh, extern uh, side. Or no, that's the wrong. Where is my? So okay. Now we try to start here in Innsbruck.
Yes. So we are lift off and who and try to hoover a little bit here. Okay. Now we get a bit of, a little bit forward. So and fly up to the up to the mountains, okay. <laughs> now it's a little bit uh, it's beginning night, dawn I see. I think that's the right what so I have uh, switch on the landing light. Can we see this? No, we can see it's not. Okay. So, we have a little force here, but not too strong. But we can uh, steer the helicopter very well. So I can show you the other profile. That's a little bit. Difficult profile. So I touch down. So now we can activate the program. So okay. With auto drive. Let's see what this do. So we initiation. Now we have the initiations. Okay. Nothing change. We have to start. Oh, 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 now I have to, I feel the, uh, the fault of the, of the rotor blades. So I have to, to working against this, this force. If I create this uh, profile, I have the idea that the uh, that the blade, that the rot rotor blade, create forces to the stick. And so I have. Uh, now you can see here how the stick is, is, is working because uh, uh, the reaction of the forces of the blades, main blades of the helicopter. I don't know what is really 
what is in the reality because I'm not a helicopter pilot so okay the flashlight is on <laughs> can fly a little bit here and look the airport and this beautiful area here that sunset I think yes is that sunset this looks beautiful great very good I love flying in VR and I love flying here in Innsbruck. It looks so great with the lights. Okay, the uh, lights here are blinking. They have to repair. <laughs> That's the uh, airport Innsbruck. Okay. I think that was that was it what I want to show you in Microsoft Flight Simulator. You can uh, create several uh, profiles for several several uh, flight plans. looks so great okay then I try to land here and in the next capture we look we have a look at the system in the simulator DCS Okay, see you at Capta 3. So, welcome to Capta 3, flying in DCS. Before we are flying DCS, we have to change the setting. So, we get into the uh, control program settings and we have to switch from Microsoft Flight Simulator to DCS World. Okay, so if we have to do that we have to connect the base so here we have connect and then and now we we uh, choose uh, the profile we want to fly and I want to fly an F-14 so I have to choose 
where, where I have this. Uh, so many profiles. So F18, F14 here. Okay, then we can initiate it. So Okay, now we have a uh, fourth part. We are not uh, connected with the, with the simulation because the simulation we have to start. Okay, then we start the simulation. Okay, welcome to DTS, chapter three. Before we start to fly, I have to change the stick because I want to fly with a with a replicate of the F14 uh, flight stick. So this is the flight stick from Willpill. Weapon choose trim fire of uh, rockets, no, fire of bombs, fire of guns and rockets, nose wheel, and this uh, you can uh, deactivate the stabilization of uh, pitch and roll. So, this is the stick and we change it. So we have to loose this screw here, then we put it up. So yes, and then we have to put the right okay. No, that's not right. So I have to look carefully. So it's connected and now I can fix the, the stick with a screw here. So and we can can shoot the uh, so that's okay so okay then we have to say the program that we have a new stick. Now we disconnect now we have to connect so okay sorry so we connect it connecting 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 so it's connected then we get to the profile manager. This is the profile manager. To buttons, and here we can choose uh, the stick. Now we have the F14 stick. Okay. Here we can uh, say what the stick have to do with the knobs. Here we have the uh, hardware trim. You see, if I use the uh, Trim uh, pitch down, the stick moving uh, to the front, and now he moved to the to the back. Now this is the uh, uh, this is a reset, which the stick get in the middle. Then we have here the aileron trim. And now in the middle. Okay. So, 
that's okay. Then we can change it. Okay, so now we can fly. So now we are here in Chapter 3. We are at the carrier deck and in the beautiful F-14 Tomcat. Oh yeah. Okay. Now we are we have here our stick. The stick is uh, matching with uh, with all the switches from our system. Here's a hardware switch. So here is a um bump or yes bump uh switch okay so this is the normal uh force of the system and we try to start this little bird okay so flaps are off, okay. So no steel steering on. Little power. And we try to go to the catapult. Or drive to the catapult. So braking. What we have to do? Okay. So. So. Okay. What doing the the man here? Okay. So, I'm in. Okay. So, I have to... To do my... Okay, the wings are sweeped. Sweeped out. So, do that. Okay. Flaps. All okay. So, wipe out. First of all, power. Oh, this power. Oh, yeah. It's one, two, three, four. Okay, and salutieren. Now we should. Okay. And we are in the in the sky. So Oh yeah That's cool
now we have uh, a little vibrations here. Now we fly a little bit faster. Come on. Yeah. That sounds good. The wings sweep in because we raised up speed or we, we uh, have more speed so and uh, uh, Well, this is a carrier. That was a carrier, okay. That's so cool. Okay. I think I get in trouble. So you can see the force is a little bit more, and uh, the hardware trim is. Very good, I can uh, trim them the mesh out. I have to to get front, so I I use the hardware trim to reduce the power of the stick. And so I can trim the beast Doing good fly. Okay. Now we can try a little landing here. Oh, oh, oh. If I get go into the turn, I feel the vibration. Oh no 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 no! no. Okay, that's not good. That happened.